Coming up after the break, the Magnetic Island Race Week comes to a close and students put their metal on display as they pedal to victory. Local students are feeling the need for speed, helping design and build a three-wheeled bike for a technology challenge this Saturday. And it better be made to last the distance, as the competition is a very long haul. 24 hours of almost non-stop pedal power. That's what these Kerwin High students will need to endure if they're to take out the Maryborough Technology Challenge. There's a number of events that are on down there relating to industry subjects at schools. Um, we're entering into the human powered vehicle event. Last year a team of boys brought home the Spirit Award and came in 62nd out of 122 entrants. This year two teams will contest. We've got two pit crew and six riders and we interchange like in every half an hour intervals and just uh, do as many laps as we can. The school's hoping their first all-girl team will be their secret weapon and already their popularity is catching on. Team work's pretty good considering that um, we've only really met each other um, recently and um, we, had a, we bonded real well and um, we really want to work as a group. But it hasn't all been an easy ride with the students having to use their studies to devise a suitable speed racer. It's got skinnier wheels which um, reduces the friction on the road and the seat's down lower so the air resistance and um, so some physics is involved. The bikes can reach speeds of up to 50 kilometres an hour, so naturally the pressure is on. We expect that they should come in the top five. Simon Ward, Win News.